large cargo ship can carry thousands, or even tens of thousands of containers, stacked up to tens of meters high. So why don't they fall over in the rough seas? First of all, all containers are standardized rectangles, most commonly used by the 20-foot and 40-foot sizes. When being loaded onto a ship, they are stacked on top of each other. The bottom of the ship is divided into standard-sized compartments, designed to fit 40-foot containers. On both sides of each cargo hold, rails are installed. The containers are placed in these rails to hold them in place. If 20-foot containers are used, since one side isn't secured by the rails, there's a risk of sideways sliding. In this case, a locking mechanism is used to secure the four corners. Additionally, 40-foot containers are stacked on top to increase stability. Once the hold is full, a hatch cover is placed on top. More containers are stacked on the deck. However, stacking on the deck carries more risk, as there are no rails to secure them. Between containers, a locking device is used. Each corner of a container has a hollow corner casting, and between the stacked containers, a twist lock is inserted to secure them together. Once turned, the lock acts like a pin to firmly connect the containers. There are also semi-automatic twist locks that rotate and lock into place automatically. To unlock them, you just need a tool to pull the latch. For added safety, rods and pins are used to tie each row of containers together, reducing the risk of collapse. To maximize deck space for containers, base supports are used for the outermost containers. These spots are often used for refrigerated containers. Thousands of containers are loaded onto each ship in this way. However, despite all the precautions, due to accidents, bad weather, or improper securing, many containers fall overboard every year. Once they fall into the sea, they are rarely recovered due to high costs and damage to the goods caused by salt water. Their fate is either sinking to the ocean floor or drifting endlessly in the sea. Each row of containers is tied down to reduce the risk of collapse. To maximize the container load on deck, the outermost containers on cargo ships are usually supported by bases. These spots are often used for refrigerated containers. Every cargo ship carries tens of thousands of containers, all loaded according to these standards. Even if everything seems securely loaded due to shipping accidents, severe weather at sea, or improper manual fastening, Many containers fall overboard each year. The containers that fall into the ocean are typically left alone due to high recovery costs. Or because seawater damages the cargo, their fate is either sinking to the ocean floor or drifting endlessly across the sea. If you happen to find one, could you take it home with you? Or they just keep drifting at sea? If you accidentally found one, could you take it home?